What's good? It's your boy Carcino here. Let's talk about it. Look, when all the chips are down and the chips fall, you got to ask yourself something. And you ask yourself, is it all worth it? And that's what T.I. is going to have to go through. Because word around the campfire, he ain't even allowed back in the house right now. Like him and Tiny ain't really been on too much of speaking terms. And if he come by the house, she making sure she ain't there. And he's used to having conversations and control. So she's really changing the narratives on him using that strategy. Taking away what he's used to be being comfortable to. So the show family values that they used to be on having these spats. And every time they have a spat, the show ended with very high ratings due to the Mayweather drama the last time. And they ended up splitting up for real on the show. And now, with all this extra attention on T.I. and him going out with another girl when they were trying to work on bridging their marriage back together, a new situation, a new offer came to renew the Family Value show. So, that's back on the table. VH1 is very excited would be very excited to bring back the show with all missed all the new controversy that's going on they think this would be great television but T.I. made a statement said to whom it may concern it ain't come for me or major girl it ain't real family hustle on ice until further notice thanks <laughs> so Anybody want to go check T.I. out? He's in the new movie, Ant-Man and the Wasp. And he has a new BET show called The Grand Hustle, where contestants will compete for a position at his record label. The winner will get a six-figure salary. We've seen this show done like two, three different times. This will be no different. Now, on top of this, we have everything that was going on at the time that was blowing up for T.I. He was doing his us or else. His his push for free and meek meal, fighting restaurant owners. He was doing a lot of things to keep his name out there. Now, we going to lead that protest until you start treating black people the way they supposed to be treated. Treated at your restaurant, then we ain't going to frequent your establishment. So, a couple of people decided to sue T.I. They didn't realize that was a very futile point, is to try to sue him. At the time, makes no sense. But whatever. Now, we have an even different situation. Because once that thing hit, you know, Tiny was one of the main ones on the front lines. When the thing hit the internet, the kids were the first ones to see it. That's the hurtful part. When he was out there with that inspiring actress, the kids saw that. So they were more hurt than anybody. And very disappointed in dad. So the whole thing broke down like this. Hey, what's going on, kid? Where your mom at? She don't want to talk to you. We don't want to talk to you either. I, oh, you believe in the internet? 
Man, that thing was grainy. That might not have been me. I don't even know what, what was going on at that time. A lot of people just sat next to me. I probably gave them a hug. I don't know. I'm out there trying to do my show. Look like I was on the phone. I don't even know if that was me. Tell her, let's let me talk to her for a minute. I'm going to come on over to the house. Don't come over here. Tell Tip I ain't trying to see him. He know that with him on there. He know that what he do. If he ain't even man enough to admit it, then I ain't even got nothing to say to him. And he ain't need to be in his house. He don't respect us. I ain't gonna respect him. He don't gonna deserve to be. I didn't spend a million dollars on that house. What you mean? I don't. You don't got to respect me. You respect my money when you out there spending it. I make my own money now. I'm out there doing my tour. Escape. We doing good. We doing good. Listen, you doing good because I gave you the connections. Now, I ain't going to tell you my parental rights, but I got a right to be there. That's my house. We ain't got a divorce yet. That's still my house. In my house. I went out and buy my own house until the court say something. This is still my house, and I don't want you in it. So you stay away. Your kid don't want you here either. They mad at you. Back in the day when you used to be the king, then you would let all that king stuff go to your head. We don't want you in the house. Well, I think otherwise. I think you are getting very poor advice at this moment in time. And it is advantageous for you to have this conversation with me right now. Because... If we don't have this face-to-face -face conversation in the house, it's going to be done another way. And it won't be nice. <laughs> this is how... Uh, we've spoken about this before. But people keep running back to the same situation they've always been in. She keeps running right back. She don't like it, but she runs right back. Now, this time, people are like, look, you the fool. Because we told you last time when you was crying. Go on and get away. Get away from the situation. But she keep running back. So, obviously, the passion is worth it. You know how some women are willing to put up with a man's BS to a certain degree? Well, it seems like she's arrived at that degree. And because she's arrived at that degree, she is hard to complain. So, well, what could you complain about? You wanted this, and you're getting exactly what you signed up for. So, no pity. Not it.